Okay, we're kind of to the end of the road here in this um, unit. Um, what you have here is some equations where you have the, this E right here. And um, there is a way you get rid of the E, but you have to rewrite. This button on your calculator is kind of the key. It's the third key down, LN. Okay, so you're solving each equation for X. And first thing you're going to do is treat E just like a variable. But if it's to a power, you need to parenthesize a power. Okay, so that's your first step. You have a multiplier of 2 here, so the first thing we have to do is divide by our 2. Okay. Not my pen. I don't have a pen, so it makes it kind of hard to see. So I'll do my best with the pencil. So I need to divide by 2. And I didn't give you much room here. So now I have e to the x power, keep the parentheses going, equals 9. Now here, now it's time to get rid of the e. This is how you get rid of the e. You write two simple letters, ln, and you put it on the other side too. Because an ln and an e cancel out, and then I have the x. Now you're like, well, what do I do to the other side? You go to your calculator, you find ln. LN is known as the natural log, LN9, okay, so 2.20, or 2 point, if you miss round, that's fine. Okay, so the and all, they're all going to be decimals here, so again, I parenthesize the E and the exponent, okay, so my exponent's going to be X. Divide by 5, but don't worry about that yet. Get rid of the plus 4, so you'd subtract 4, and that gives me 3. Keep the parentheses going. Now it's time to get rid of Mr. E here. So I put LN, LN. That cancels. Now I have X divided by 5. Okay, It's just right now it's no longer an exponent. But the other side I have to type in LN3. So LN's this key here. 1.10. Now the opposite of divide by 5 is multiply by 5. Okay. You could just multiply them if you don't want to show that. You just take 1.10 times 5. 5.5. 5. Okay, next problem. Parenthesize the E and its exponent. It's always going to have an exponent. Okay, because so first off, I get rid of this 4. Now, 4 is in the front, so I divide by 4. So that's going to be 3 e to the 2x. Okay, time to say goodbye to Mr. E. LN, LN. Get rid of that. We have 2x. Now I just find LN3. Okay, 1.10 again. Now you have to divide by 2. So and that's my answer. So 1.10 divided by 2 is going to be 0 0.55. Okay, so again, I, I mean, if I see E, I need to parenthesize that because I have to solve for the X. Okay. Now, I don't have anything going on outside like I did on these first three, okay? So it's time to do the LN right away, get rid of Mr. E. So now I have X divided by 2, and then I find LN 5. 1.61. So the opposite of divides multiply, so I multiply by 2 and multiply by 2. So I got 1.61 times 2, 3.22. Okay, next problem. Again, I always want to parenthesize. I got to solve for x. Okay, e is just a number. Okay, that you're gonna. It's it's kind of far out there. I will admit. There's nothing going on outside of our little power. So time for Mr. E to go bye-bye. And I find LN. You can just put the LN on top of 30. So I have X plus 1. I just find LN 30. 
Then I subtract 1, and 3.40 minus 1 is 2.4, okay? There you have it. If you, yep. Okay, E, 2X, again, outside you got a 5, so you're going to divide by 5. So we have 2. Okay, time to say goodbye to Mr. E, ln, and now I have 2x, but then I have to find the ln of 2. It's called the natural log of 2. You'd think it would be nl if that's what it stands for, but nl, so ln of 2. 0 0.69, then I just divide by 2 and I have my answer for x. Zero point three five. Okay, here again. Now get rid of your plus five before you worry about anything else. So that takes that side to one. And say goodbye to Mr. E. Okay. So three X. I find the natural log of 1, 0, okay? Then I divide by 3, and I'm still at 0. So I can get 0 for an answer, that's fine. Okay, so plus 8, plus 8, x divided by 9, 6 plus 8 is 14. Now we've got to get rid of e. So I have x divided by 9, and then ln 14, okay, just like that, 2.64, and then the opposite of uh, divide by 9 is times 9, and that's my answer. <coughs> so 2.64 times 9 is 23.76. All right.